Real quick, guys, you know, my name is Felipe. I'll tell you a little bit about my back, background story. You know, I came here um, when I was really, really young. And, uh, you know, I, I never really knew what I wanted to do in life. You know, I wanted to go to college, obviously, and I just couldn't go because I didn't have any money. Um, and, you know, I got to push this opportunity by, by my boy Austin Mueller right here. And I'm, you know, I, I'm blessed enough to be speaking up here, man, because if it wasn't for, you know, for him, for Julian, for, you know, my boy Chris Bach, and that's Sonny Arkansas, and Miles, I mean, I could keep going on and on and on, I wouldn't be standing here right now. You know what I mean? Teach you, you about, you know, events. Who wants to learn about events? Yeah. Yeah. You know, obviously, I've had a lot. Um, you know, it gets pretty dirty, right? But it's a lot of fun, man. It's at your house, right? You have to go anywhere, man. So, you know, real quick, guys, welcome Powerhouse Georgia. Oh. Can you guys hear me back there? Really useful. <laughs> All right, real quick, sir. Um, guys, so you know about home events. Um, you know, there's a lot of things that I want to go over. Um, for me, it's probably one of the most important things in this business, just because you know, obviously, we have like five, ten events a day, right? You know what I mean? As young people, so you know, obviously, we we need a you know, we need we have some requirements, man. Some things that we need to bring to the event. For example, the first, the, the number one thing we need is what? Verb, right? We need to have some verb, right? You know, everybody opens up their house, and if you don't bring verb, it's kind of like, you know, the person that is opening the house, you know, they're like, man, I have to waste all my verb now. You know what I mean? So bring a verb, guys. If you're bringing three people, bring four verbs, right? One for you, right? And then one for everybody else. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes. You know, if you guys are not bringing you, anyone, just bring one for yourself because you're going to get thirsty. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, num number two thing, guys, you guys want to have some music playing. Okay? Yeah. You definitely have to have some music, guys. Have you guys ever been to a party and there's no music? <laughs> okay, it's pretty awkward, right? <laughs> so, guys, have some music playing, guys. Uh, number three, guys, you know, I don't, it doesn't matter if, you know, you're having a bad day, and, you know, if, you're, if your fish died or something, right? You know, leave all negative emotions behind, okay? I understand that, you know, we go through some rough times, you know, in our day, right? But... If we go into the house, right, to the event, and we're always frowning, we're crying, we're just sitting there on the couch, how is that going to feel, guys? So be happy, guys. Put, 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 a, put a smile on your face, guys. Ear to ear, baby, you know what I mean? So guys, just you know, put a smile on your face. I want everyone to smile real quick. I love it, right? I'm excited, guys. Uh, number four, guys, I want you guys to bring your list. I think that's a you know, really, really important thing to do. If you bring your list, that's gonna help you guys in the closing part, okay? And I'll go over that in just a second. Number five, guys, you wanna be on time, okay? Um, you know, obviously there's a bunch of sapphires, a lot of young people in the room, right? Um, you guys wanna be on time. If we say the event at seven, just get there at like 6.55, right? Don't get there at like eight o'clock and say, yo, did the event start? Yeah, it's started, guys. You know what I mean? So obviously be on time, guys. We gotta be on time because we gotta be, you know, we gotta think about those people that got there on time. Does that make sense? You know what I mean? And number number five, number six, guys, be respectful. You know, with the house. You know, don't you know if, if you spill something, clean it up or whatever. Be, be respectful. Clogging toilets. Clogging toilets. <laughs> All righty. If you yeah, if you bring someone to the event, the event is for them. Okay. If you don't bring anyone to the event, the event is for you, and the event needs you. Okay. Wow. Just like Chris Brown said, man. You know, so obviously. Before the event starts, guys, um, this is really, really important. You want to introduce your friends to every single person in the room, okay? Have you guys been to a party before, right, where you have no idea who's at the party, right? Your friend just brought you to a party, right? And he goes in, he's like excited, he's like, you know, what up, you know, friends, 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 right? And you're in the back, you're like, um, all right, you know, you pull out, you pull out your phone, you're just like... But you don't, you're not really talking to anybody, right? You know, it's awkward, guys. So obviously, what you want to do, guys, is you want to bring your new friends, okay, to everybody. You want to introduce them to everybody in the room. What does that, what does that do? Okay, it makes them feel comfortable. Okay, it makes them want to be there. Okay, that's what we need to do. We need our, our, our new friends that come into the room to be comfortable. All right. Number two, guys, when introducing your friends, you know, to you know the the brand partners in the room, what you want to do, guys, is you want to you know, you want to edify them. You know, for example, you know, hey man, Miles, you know, I, I'm, I'm glad you're here tonight, man. I want you to meet, you know, my boy Chris Bogdan. You don't even, you don't, you don't understand, man. I don't even know if you, you know, we have like two minutes to talk to him. 
he's really, really important, guys. You know, he, he came over here from San Diego, California. You know, maybe I can, you know, maybe he can shake your hand or something, you know what I mean? You know, oh my God, dude, I want, you, I want you to meet, you know, Mr. Lee. This guy's hilarious, man, he's changing so many lives. Man, I want you to meet this person, this person, this person. What does that do? Okay, the new people in the room, they're like, wow. All these people are so interesting, right? You know, I want to be just like those guys. What are they doing? Does that make sense? So what they do, they actually, they, they, they feel respect for you and everybody in the room and they'll listen. They'll have an open mind, okay? Guys, 90% of the closing happens before the event starts, okay? I understand, you know, we have events, like five events a day, you know, but see, an event, guys, is like a play, okay? When you walk into that house, you're not supposed to be talking to brand partners, okay? If you're a brand partner, they're not making you money, okay? Talk to the newest people. The reason why you do that is so you get to know everything about them. You get to know why they need this business, okay? For example, you know, if I knew, you know, that Bobby wanted to retire his parents right before the event started, after the event, I can go back to him and say, man, we can help you out with your parents. You know, this is perfect for you. Does it make sense? Wow. But if I didn't know that, I'm gonna go up to Bobby later on after the event, say, hey man, my name is Felipe, you don't know me, and then waste my time. Does it make sense? Yeah. So b before the event, you get to know every single person, okay? Yeah, um, and always, you know, always, always be talking to somebody, okay? If you see someone that's new, go introduce yourself, yeah. okay? If you see someone that's new and they're sitting, you know, in the corner, in the couch, is on their phone, go up to them and talk to them, okay? They want that, okay? Like I said, man, the event is like a play. Everyone is a character with a role, okay? What not to say at the event. Okay, I want to go over what not to say at the event. When you bring someone into a house, okay, you know, your new friend, don't call him a prospect, okay? It's like, guys, 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 I want you guys to meet my prospect, Ree. You know what I mean? How does Ree feel? Does that make sense? Make him feel special, okay? Make him feel special. Say, man, I'm excited for you to be here. You know what I mean? Never talk about, when you walk into the room, when you walk into the event, don't talk about your business, guys, okay? Never, never go up to, to you know, the brand partners, the all-point leaders, whoever, and say, man, so how many cycles do you have? You know what I mean? So how many points, you know? Let's just say, you know, again, let's just say Re was new to the business, right? I'm like, yo, Tom, man, dude, it's like $500, right? It's $500 to start up, right? You know what I mean? Okay, I wasn't sure, right? What does Re think, right? He's like, wait, there's money involved? No, thank you. He wants. He, he's gonna have a closed mind, guys. So don't talk about the business, guys. Don't talk about not people showing up. You know, you don't want to say, "Oh my God, Miles, you're the only one that showed up." <laughs> but, Miles, dude, this, dude, this thing is hard. I invited like ten. You only showed up, man. <laughs> right? No, dude, make him feel special, dude. If my if Miles was the only one that came here to the room, I mean to the event. You want to say, bro, listen, man, I invited three people. You're the only one that showed up, man. I'm, I'm excited for you. You know, you are lucky for coming here. Wow. You know, make you feel special. Sure. Like Chris Bogner said, the energy doesn't come from the speaker. It comes from the crowd. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. You want to be excited, guys. Guys, doing a presentation, okay? Obviously, if we say something funny, just laugh. Right? I don't care if you don't think it's funny, okay? You know, if, if, if Alistair Kalusa is like laughing like, you know, a donkey, right? I just laugh, dude. <laughs> guys, you know, always, you know, clap, guys, you want to participate with the speaker, okay? So if I say, raise your hand, what do you do? Raise your hand, right? Who wants to make a million dollars? Me, right? Guys, that, that definitely, you know, helps the speaker out a lot. Um, you know, and, and number two, when you say wow, when you say wow, you know, dang, that's awesome, guys. You know, don't be sarcastic about it. You know, the, the new people in the room can tell when you're joking around. You know what I mean? If you say, oh, wow, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? Dude, no, that's not cool, man. You want to be genuine, guys. Another point that I, obviously Chris touched, as you want to, you know, doing an event, guys, don't just sit back, you know, don't be on your phone, don't slouch, right? Just be up front, guys. I want everyone to do this. Go up to the front of your seat and go like this, right? This is awkward for me, okay? <laughs> Guess what, guys? You gotta get uncomfortable, okay? If you guys do that, the new people <clears throat> in the room that are slouching, they're gonna look at you and say, wow, maybe I need to pay attention. Maybe I need to look forward. Does that make sense? Wow. Yes. Wow. So cool. 
And the last part, guys, the, the event shouldn't be more than 30 minutes, okay? Um, I understand, you know, we, we like to be up here talking and stuff, um, you know, for a long time, but, but if, you, if you, you know, if you go on for more than 30 minutes, um, the people in the room are gonna get bored, okay? They're gonna, they're gonna get sidetracked, okay? So keep it in 30 minutes, like that. <laughs> and the lineup, again, some people, you know, different people do it, you know, different ways, but, you know, usually the person that owns the house they should come up and welcome everybody. Okay, they should welcome everybody into the and, and, you know to the house. You know, saying you know, welcome to my house. I'm excited for you guys to be here tonight. You know, whoever brought you here tonight, you know, obviously, you know, respects you. You know, he wants to show you something that's going to help you. You know, with your future. Okay, then he's gonna he's gonna edify the video. You know, when you play a video right after that same guy comes up. Okay, and he's gonna um, give his testimony. Okay. Then he's gonna bring up three people to do their testimonials, or how we like to call them, testy minutes, okay? <laughs> All right, is that, is that, you know, those people that come up there, is that to talk about your life story, okay? It's literally to say, why are you doing this? Why do, we, why do you wanna do this? You know, Reed comes up, man, I wanna do this, you know, cause I wanna help all my parents, I wanna be able to pay for college, you know, I got, you know, I, I made $900 my first week, I'm excited, boom, that's it. Wow. That's it, yeah. okay? Then the next person usually comes up and talks about you know the the whole the facts about the, the the economy guys the school you know he opens up your mind okay and the last person is the, the person that talks about the business okay you know it should be 30 minutes consistent guys get to the point okay um and it, it will be an, um a great event yes Can I go back <laughs> like I said before, guys, 90% of the closing happens before the event starts, okay? After, after the event ends, guys, you know, when the event ends, it's not time to go home, okay? It's time to close, okay? Obviously, when the, in the business to get people in the business. Does that make sense? All right? So if you go home, no one's going to get closed, okay? So even if you didn't bring anybody, guys, you go there and help the team out, okay? It doesn't matter if you didn't bring anybody, guys. Now, this, this is a tip of the day, okay? For the people that don't know how to close, what you guys wanna do, if you guys don't know how to close, stay after the event and just literally go up to an upline leader, okay? Go up to Miles, guys, Matt Tennis, anybody, okay? That's your upline leader and just, just sit there and just pay attention, okay? Anything that they say, guys, take notes on it, okay? But don't interrupt. You don't wanna inter interrupt someone closing, okay? Yes. Um, it's really important, guys. When closing, don't. Okay. When closing, guys, don't go over the whole presentation again. Okay. Um, you know, you, you don't want to be like, yo, dude, re, re. so, so, you know, the company's Vima, uh, essential vitamins, essential minerals, mangosteen and aloe. I don't know if you caught that. Okay. Um, all that, guys, they already know. All you gotta do is go up to them and say, man, I'm excited. You ready to start it? Yes or no? Boom. That's it. All right. You ready to start it? What did you like best, the business or the product, okay? If they have questions, answer the questions.